Hello. As you might be able to tell, I have a very low voice today. Um, I'm not sure if I have another cold or it's allergies. Um, I just had a cold last month on my birthday. Um, so I don't think I've got another cold already. And I don't feel ill, but my nose is very swollen and lots of... Do we have a polite word for it in English? I've always just called it snot. I have lots of snot. But in Japanese you say hanemizu, which is nose water, which is much better. Um, so yeah, so I'm feeling a bit off. But feeling ill gives me a nice feeling of immunity. I feel like I'm already ill, so nothing bad will happen, <laughs> which is good. So this weekend, not been doing a lot. Today, I went to Starbucks to do some work, and I can show you what I've been doing. I've been making an ideas chart for my next novel. My next novel is... I'll show you in a second. Oh, here we go. My next novel is set in a fantasy world where everybody is a superhero, apart from one character. So, I've been thinking how the world would be different if everybody had superhero superpowers. For example, if everybody had super strength, we wouldn't need shopping trolleys. We wouldn't need cranes to make buildings. We would probably never have used horses to pull loads. Therefore, we wouldn't have a close relationship with them. Um, and such like that. Sports would be grander. For example, home runs would be commonplace. Um, soccer pictures would, pictures would probably be twice as big or something. Or, as a better example, if everybody could fly, how would the world have developed differently? There would be no stairs and such. People would just fly out of buildings. Um, there would be no vehicles. So there'd be no roads. There'd be less pollution. Um less pollution and more animals and such so I think it's very cool I like creating and thinking of these ideas but I never know if I have them all I bet as I'm writing my story I will come across new situations and I'll think hang on if everybody can fly then why is this here and then I'll have to change my story but that's okay it's part of the fun Yesterday, what did I do yesterday? I went shopping, I think, and just had a relaxing evening. Watched some TV. The Shimura Zoo is very good. I like watching the animals. And I did some drawing and stuff. Just relaxing. During the day, I had to go back to the vets to give my cat a new bandage. It's a very easy job. I would like to do it myself, but the vet says we have to go there every time. So I couldn't go to the sports competitions this weekend. I wanted to go because I don't often watch the sports. And last year when I went to the tennis, um, I started speaking to some students. And for the rest of the year, those students spoke to me a lot more. So I was kind of hoping that would happen with some more students this year. But never mind. Sometimes these things can't be avoided. Anyway, because of the sports competitions, my Monday and Tuesday is free. I have no work. Or rather, I don't have to go into school. I still have lots of work to do. But I can work at home or maybe in the coffee shop. So it's nice. So I'll see you then. Goodbye.